Tonight we talked with a local electrician about the helpful tool you can keep in your pocket to make sure your children are safe near fountains, splash pads, other water attractions. Suji Nam has that story. As a father myself, it's like, I don't know what I would do in that scenario. Rafael Simon is a master electrician in Palm Beach County and says the horrifying accident that happened in the Harborside Place Fountain is rare. Palm Beach County Fire Rescue says two adults and three children were rushed to the hospital. Something outside of the norm happened that took a distribution voltage and somehow energized either the plumbing, the water, or the ground in that immediate vicinity. And Simon says tools like this, a voltage detector, can provide parents with another level of protection as they can help detect static and electricity nearby. The more voltage that's present, like which sounds like potentially that was the case in this situation, this thing would be ringing from potentially 10, 20, 30 feet away. Simon demonstrated for us how these tracers work. This water has no voltage in it, uh, but if it did have voltage present, the it would em uh, emit a tone and a light. We asked the expert, what if the tool initially detected no electricity, but something sparked spontaneously in the water? He said that would be a very rare case. If there's a voltage present, it's going to be present for a period of time. Um, to have an accident or an incident happen that could potentially energize the water would be, I think that, you know, lightning strike is it's probably more probable in the water while you're in it. Simon says if parents hear that beeping tone, they and their children should step away and call 911. In Palm Beach County, I'm Suji Nam for WPBF 25 News.